here having some fun with Captain Greg, as always. He's a charter guy. If you guys want to come catch yourself some big snook, some slot snook, reds, anything here at Sebastian Inlet, go right ahead. And I would honestly do it because if you could tell, half of the north side is still closed. So unless you sneak out and you'll get in trouble, you should come fish on a boat. Come fish with Greg. He'll put you on. But black drum, reds, snook, sheep's head, anything like that is on the table today. It's very cold out. I'm freezing. I don't know if Greg, are you cold, Greg? It's a little, a little yeah, it's a little nippy. I'm, we're both Floridians at heart, so it's kind of cold. We'll we see what we can do today. Gear for me, I got two setups. BG, 3K, 20 pound Beyond Braid, eight foot custom to 30 pound liter to size one hook. And we got shrimp today. I also got a chicken rig on this combo right here in case some black drums swim by. We're just going for variety today in this video. That's the goal. I haven't been fishing in a little bit, trying to get my my juice back. Greg told me we're going to get the juice back today. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. You got a fish on the drum rod. I don't know. Good head shakes, good head shakes. Could be a jack though. Yeah. Oh, you got one of my rod too? It's a little blue fish. I was. You were too? What you got? Oh. Ooh, come on, Greg. Get him, Greg. It's not. Let me know if you need the net. Come on, show him the business. Show him the business. I see leader. Is a snug? Let's get the net. Here he comes. Oh, I just had a fish. Oh, you sure? Yep, my fish is still there. Mine's small, something small. Are you kidding me? No way, I got this one. Are you kidding me? I catch a jack, and then my dog Greg gets a nice little slot snook. Might be a little big and slow. Show him to the camera. Nice little snook. Woo, he is a fat one. Send him back. All right, let's see if we can do it again now. I got a bag. Why? Oh, it's a stupid jack though. That ain't Jack. Woo! He is a. If it's a Jack, it's a big Jack. That they no Jack though. You keep saying that. <laughs> you gotta be right one of these times. Like I said, guys, it is every drop right here. So you definitely need to go fish with Greg because 
I don't know any other charter out here that will catch them in every cast almost right now. Oh, we got a double up. This thing's putting in the work. He's got some weight to him. He's got some weight to him. Watch this be a jack that I hooked sideways on accident. You change your answer just like that? Nice snook egg. Nice snook. Woo! Man, it's a... Nice little snook, guys. First one I've caught in a long time, but I'm happy. Snook season's almost open, but by the time this video's out, it will be. But today, when we're fishing, it's not. We gotta let them all go so they can make some more babies for us. There he goes. Before we continue with the video, guys, just want to give a huge shout out to Waterland Sunglasses. They are a big supporter of the channel. They support a whole bunch of fishing creators, including myself. They got amazing sunglasses. They got amazing shirts. They got amazing hats. They just are a great company. They got different types of styles. They got different types of lenses. They got plastic. They got glass lenses. They even have prescription sunglasses. So if you need some of those, they got you covered. Go check them out, guys, at waterlandsunglasses.com. And if you guys use this discount code that is popping up right now, you guys will get yourself a nice discount. Enough talking. Let's get back to the video. Yes, come off. I got your line, that's why. Would you, did I, sheep's head? Really? Come on, get the sheep's head up. Huh? Oh, it's a good one, it's a good one, not a bad one. What made, how'd you know it was sheepy? He <laughs> do, I didn't think you did. I thought you were an amateur at this. This might be the drum. It might, this might be the drum. This has to be the drum. There's not, a snook won't just do this. Yeah, this might be big ugly. Uh huh? Ooh. Couldn't be a grouper. There's no way it's a Goliath, because I can I can handle it. No, no stingray. Yeah, this ain't a stingray. I hope it's not either. It's Mr. Big Ugly, like I said. <laughs> yeah. Like I said, Mr. Ugly. That is a good one. I was wanting to catch one of these today because I haven't in such a long time. It ain't a bad one. It ain't a bad one. Ooh! 
I got the pliers. Some sweet Danko pliers. Use my code to get a nice little discount at their website. Look at that. You hear me because of the wind. A beautiful little drum. I was wanting a little bit bigger, but honestly, I will happily take this. Some people like keeping them this size. Me, yeah, it's not really my thing, so we're going to let him go here. Sure. All right, y'all, we're going to let him go here. Usually you would revive him, but since it's so windy, we're just going to give him a little head dive. I didn't even feel that guy eat it. I just reeled up, felt a little weight. I'm like, oh, okay. Chomp it. Yep. Snook. That's a nice snook. Maybe not. Maybe a drum. Got to be. Size shrimp winter time it's oh he just get yeah he just got eaten by a goliath oh no huh no i just got all this line back bro please don't be a good buddy and don't do this Watch it just be like an 80 pound drum though. There's a good chance it could be that. I don't know though. <laughs> you still haven't gotten eaten yet? What about fishing your first? He's coming up. Well, I did have him. Broke off. <laughs> 